Hello. Today I'll be teaching you how to draw a realistic glass using a Prismacolor marker and uh, mechanical pencils. So I started drawing an outline of the glass looking at the picture. I used mechanical pencil here and then after the outline has been drawn I used Prismacolor cool gray. Uh, it's like 30% cool gray. So I started putting down the gray shades that I see in the actual picture. I, I did not use any grid method or anything like that. I just randomly started putting uh, all the gray tones on the paper. Now I am using 60% gray, cool gray from Prismacolor marker as well just to add more darker shades onto my drawing. As you can see the cool gray 30% is way lighter than 60% so instead of using uh, graphite pencils and blending around I, I, I started liking this cool gray marker. So it, was, it, it was pretty easy to put down the tones using the marker here. Don't uh, bother about the intricate details, but uh, just uh, just look at the picture and wherever you see gray, light gray and darker gray, just start putting the values onto the paper. You will just keep practicing this way and eventually you will get better with more and more practices. I have not zoomed in the real picture yet, I just, uh, I was just looking at the uh, real picture from far and uh, I just started putting the gray marker on the paper. Now I'm using white paint marker. I personally prefer Uni Posco <coughs> brand. It is av <coughs> it's available in Amazon. So now what I'm doing is I'm just looking at the picture from far and <coughs> wherever the there are highlights like white highlights I see which are actually the reflections of the light in the picture so I just started putting down those white highlights on the paper now uh, I'm using Prismacolor white pencil just to fill in those gaps where I have not drawn with cool gray either 30 or 60 percent now you can see the glass is taking its shape and it's really looking like it's shining right now. Now I'm using uh, green and black uh, Prismacolor pencils again just to add those extra tones which may give you the illusion of a real glass. Continuing with the bottom part of the glass here, I started using uh, cool grey again, the markers which are 30% and 60%. As you can see, there is no particular method <coughs> of drawing here. Just, just look at the picture wherever you see the gray tone. Just start putting it on the paper and add the highlights using the white paint marker. Continue the same process on all the parts of the glass. Now this is the base of the glass. Again, I, <clears throat> I just followed the same technique here, filling in the areas uh, with white pencil, color pencil. So that's it guys, 
This is very simple technique of drawing any glass. After this I will be adding a shadow. Uh, especially <coughs> for shadow I am using a graphite pencil here. I am going to use a graphite pencil for the shadow and <coughs> make sure to uh, blend this graphite using a tissue and tissue and the blending stump and don't let the shadow stay in one place try to use the tissue and pull the shadow out you know that gives us the illusion of being real because <coughs> the shadow won't just stay in one place it just tries to stretch out away from the object to you know uh, reach the light so uh, now I'm using the white pastel just to add those extra highlights on the shadow that are coming from the glass. As you can see, I'm just trying to pull out the graphite away from the object to give the real shadow appearance. So this is the actual technique of drawing the glass. I hope you guys like it. Please uh, follow my channel for more artworks. Thank you.